So today we're going to be trying to fix the Windows 98 computer. So what's wrong with it is any full screen sort of game that requires switching graphics modes and such um, do not work. They will freeze the computer so much you can't even move your mouse. You have to hard reset. So we're going to be trying to fix this. And it all started after this video card, the ATI Radeon 9250. And I tried to install this on a computer as a video card upgrade, because the onboard video sucks. But, um, I started running into errors in Windows and mostly games after that. I was getting continuous blue screens starting up. So here's my list of things to try. So the first thing was removing and reinstalling the original drivers, which didn't work. And the next thing was trying to restore the registry, which didn't work. And then the next thing I'm going to try is either safe mode or selective startup. Which kind of isn't going to work since it's already booting. I'm going to try disk cleanup and defrag since some people suspected it might have been a failing hard drive. But I kind of doubt that because the hard drive doesn't sound bad at all. It's actually really quiet for a mechanical hard drive. I don't know if this is good. I might try swapping the RAM. That's probably not it, but I might as well try it anyways. Uh, try using msconfig and mess around with that. Um, some people suggested to reset system.dat, which I'm kind of worried about that, but this website up here said it was good. Damn it. So here's my desktop. It, the video drivers sort of crunched it up again, because it's very forty, but whatever. So we're going to try ms... no, we're going to try M msconfig. And someone said, either selective startup, or diagnostic startup. So, uh, I'm gonna try selective first. Okay, we're in no colors. Yeah. So, we've made pretty much no progress. So let's, uh, try something else. We have logged, which I'm sure that's been updated in the past five days, they've been trying to get this to work and step by step. And these are all just going to be a uh, command prompt. So um, I'm thinking... Uh, choose that one. I did boot log, why is there no graphics? I can cross out that. And before anyone says, oh, why don't you just do a clean install? Shut up. Kill yourself. Because this install is too important to just be erased. Come on, guys. Config dot old. Just in case. I know that these files are more like you'd think of them being Windows 3.1 DOS kind of files, but I'm really just trying anything here. Come on. Config dot sys. Config dot sys. Config dot. It's zero bytes. So in this page, it mentioned scan reg, which didn't work for me. And now it's going to mention to determine whether registry is damaged to do all this stuff. So I'm going to do that stuff. Oh, never mind. CD Windows. Whoops. File not found. C slash windows slash system dot dat. Do you see system dot dat in here, guys? Hey, guys, do you see it? You don't? Wow. By the way, if you're ever having a computer like this, do not use one of these keyboards. It's actual hell. File not found system dot first. So it's saying with the, what this page I'm reading is saying that you should have a system dot first file and a system dot dat file. So you rename system dot dat to a something else and then copy system dot first to system dot dat and then restart. But I don't have a system dot first file. There's a lot of systems on here. Oh, then there it is, system.dat. And one in similar size is system.rsc from March 26, 2018. 
And the fact that it's that big makes you think this is the only one that's actually a file. So I'm guessing this is its system.first file, but it's an RSC file. But the only problem is that it's really old. But I haven't really installed anything in this computer since March 26, 2018, so I think it should be safe. So I just uh, did that thing. Rename C slash Windows. Okay, so you see now we have a system.old file. That's uh, pretty big. And now we're going to uh, restart. What the hell? We've updated our clock as a result of daylight savings. So, the old registry is back. I guess the registry before I installed Norton Antivirus. Stop being blue! My monitor's blue now, guys. Uh, it's always a smart idea to keep all your drivers on your system. So I don't know if the sound's on because... Speakers aren't on, but they are now. This device is working properly? Yeah, I don't think it's working that properly. Let's hope that thing made it work. Two for two. Can't even say it. it's 256 colors, man. Can we go to good colors? In good resolution. Look at this, man. That's amazing. Get all these icons out of the way. Look at that. Chuzzle Deluxe. Cross your fingers, guys. Cross all of them. All your fingers. Look at that. It's Chuzzle Deluxe, man. Yes! Let's go. Never been so excited to play this game, man. We did it, guys. We fixed the Windows 98 machine. So yeah, pretty much. Um, so, what have we learned in this video? We learned that if you install drivers in your computer and everything breaks after that, try and restore your registry. And if scan rig doesn't work, do that weird, stupid thing that I did. Alright, so some file types and programs got a bit smashed up after I restored the registry, but shouldn't be that big of a deal to just reinstall them. But anyways, I uh, thank you guys for watching, and hope you learned something, or just enjoyed the video. And I'll see you in another video, where I probably do something with this computer. See you later!